happening right now. One minute left. Let's enjoy it. Woo! Ground gas load up complete. Go for launch. Let's do this, baby. Nice 30 seconds. Let's do this. This is the future right here. A non government funded, world's largest rocket, fastest ever, by far. The largest by far. And fully funded without the government. Go, 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 go! Go! Woo! Woo! Go, baby! Woo! Enter core at... Deep throttle. Eight plus 33 seconds into flight. Under the power of 5.1 million pounds of thrust, Falcon Heavy is headed to space. We're throttling. Look at that thing go, man. It's only the second time I've seen this. I saw the first flight live, and it was amazing. This is amazing. Look at that shot. Power and telemetry are nominal. Look at that. Vehicle is supersonic. You may have heard the call out on Thank net one. Vehicle is supersonic. Side boosters are Look at that thing. on power as we're Max through cube. the period of maximum dynamic pressure. It looks so small out there, but it's so big. Like you have no idea. It's so, so big. Looking good. You can hear the applause behind me as we've gotten past maximum dynamic pressure. Next event coming up is chillin' of the MVAC D engine. Get the turbo pump ready to ignite the main engine on the second stage in another couple of minutes. Merlin engine performance looks good. Here we go. We've begun dropping power on the side boosters to decrease loads on the center core. Here we go, baby. These are going to come down into Earth's atmosphere and they're going to land on launch pads. So that they can keep reusing them instead of throwing them away, all that money. These are the boosters. It's just such another ma amazing thing. Not only to launch this thing into space and, and, and do the things it can do and the, and the payload it can carry and the speeds that, that it goes, but also to a land precision land these on a dime these boosters on a launch pad small launch pads literally on a dime after falling from earth look at that Woo! Woo! Successful separation if you can hear me <laughs> look at that shot Side boosters have begun the boost back burn. The center core has throttled back up to power. Everything looking good on the flight of Falcon Heavy. The next major event, main engine cutoff of the center core and separation ignition of the second stage. Uh, uh. Bottom middle view shows the view looking up into the nozzle of the second stage engine. Miko. Main engine cut off. Center core shut down. Separation confirmed. Up. 
Again, over the cheering, MVACD engine up on power. It looks good. Side boosters looking good, still burning on their way back to Cape Canaveral. And the wings are starting to fold out there. Red fans are out on the center core. Bearing separation confirmed. Here comes the fairing separation, and there it goes. Woo! So we got three boosters this time. Successful shutdown. Three boosters. Of the side booster boost back burn. Oh, geez, this is I I, I keep forgetting it's three boosters instead of two. On their way back to Cape Canaveral. Center court coasting out of That's crazy, man. That's so crazy. With a nominal trajectory. That's so crazy the times we live in today, folks. And as you guys have noticed, the grid fins have deployed on the side boosters as well as the center core. Those work to help oh, guide the boosters that. back to a nice targeted soft landing. <sighs> oh, why could you right have done this yesterday? Oh, goodness. As so a reminder, nice. today we'll be attempting to recover all three of the first stage cores, and all three <sighs> boosters are currently on their way heading home. In just a few minutes, the side boosters will execute an entry keep your run, eyes. followed by a landing. Keep your eyes on the bottom three. Much the same a few minutes later. I mean, keep your eyes on all of them. Look at that view. Look at that view from landing. Oh my god. At the time of separation, the side boosters were traveling slow That's enough so to crazy. turn around and make their way Stage back to land at our side-by-side -side landing pads. The center core, on the other hand, is going <sighs> too fast to efficiently return to the Cape, so we're using our autonomous drone ship. Of course, I still love you. If we have a successful landing today, the side boosters will be reflown on our next Falcon Heavy mission, STP-2. Now, coming up at about T plus six minutes will be the side boosters re-entry burn. Acquisition of signal Bermuda. Yeah, I, I'm subscribed to them. So you'll see the side boosters on your left and I right think I screen. Am. No, I'm not. Side booster entry I'm, I'm, I'm subscribed to and SpaceX. The re entry burn beginning. Stage two trajectory nominal. And Let's do the this. burn is complete for the side boosters. Let's coming do up this. In about 30 seconds, the center core, which you see Come on the center on. screen, will begin its re-entry burn. It's coming in. It's starting to come in. This is gonna be awesome. My mind is literally being blown right now. Stage one, entry burn has started. Side boosters are transonic. And there you can see the re-entry burn for center core has begun. Coming up in about five seconds here, the side boosters landing burn will begin as well. I'm kind of in the way of this one, aren't I? Here we go! 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 Oh my god. Now we're waiting for the engine to shut down on the second stage and for the center portal to land. Now if all goes well, we'll have successfully recovered all three boosters, which we have never done before. Now coming up in about 20 seconds, we're going to listen for confirmation of Seco 1 or second engine cutoff 1.
and back shut down. Oh, I get so emotional during these. I just. Uh. And we have confirmation. Uh. I love this so much. Nominal orbit insertion. And we have that confirmed. Good orbit. Now, coming up here in about 15 seconds will be the center core landing burn beginning. <laughs> so, again, as we mentioned earlier, this is going to be a challenging landing. <laughs> landing on our drone ship. Of course, I still love you. And let's go! Let's go! The camera always goes out on this. Looks like we lost the live view. <laughs> Waiting for some confirmation and... The camera go always goes out. Looks like we landed the center core on our drone ship. Book. They'll get a feed on it. We landed the center core for the first time on our drone ship. Of course, I still love you. For the first time, we've landed all three boosters for Falcon Heavy. What an amazing day. So now we are going to take a... There it is. <laughs> Woo! Look at that. Out in the freaking ocean on a freaking dot. On a freaking target dot. Bullseye. A freaking bullseye. Three bullseyes. What an amazing accomplishment. Are you freaking kidding me? Floating in the ocean on waves that go like this. Mind blowing. Mind freaking blowing. I, I, uh, uh, there's no words. There's no words for the 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 genius engineering be, behind this. Like it's absolutely mind boggling. So far today, if you missed it, you missed a great show. Lift off right on time, 35 minutes after. I, I can't even, there's no words. As planned. Two successful landings on landing zone one and two. Center core shut down, second stage separated. Second stage <sighs> went into the desired parking orbit where we are right now. And this the isn't government funded. funded. I mean, like that, that right there. On the drone ship. Now coming up in about 20 seconds. This is funded by... One person. Of the upper stage engine to carry the payload into the desired transfer. One area. human being. We are capable of so much. Confirmation of ignition. We are up at the desired power. Tank pressure looks good. The turbine temps look good. You may have seen just the four ignition. The uh. white fluffy pieces moving away. That is solid oxygen. The stuff you breathe, it's so cold that it's solid, but it is not very dense. It's very fluffy, and it is actually attached to one of the liquid oxygen overboard drain lines that we use. So coming off is normal. Now this burn is about an 85 second burn. In that time, we'll add 2,800 meters per second to our velocity. That's more than the side boosters provided early in flight, almost as much as what the center core gave us. We've throttled down the engine to keep accelerations below the limit for our AeroSat customer. Everything continues to look good. <laughs> Someone totally like dropped their dinner there. <laughs> the back. <background. laughs> you just hear. <laughs> Something dropping on us. Now coming up in about 20 seconds. I'm just in awe right now. Insertion. Guidance engineer over one of the nets announced nominal orbit insertion. Right where we want to be, we're on a path that'll take us almost oh, This is so great. This is such great Earth. news. Well, now we're in the good orbit we want. This is such good news. Coast for the next five minutes or so, 
We'll be back with this really, this really puts minutes for the puts their mission to Mars in in in, in forward gear. No, no foreseen delays. Everything's going nominally. It's just awesome. Apparently the second stage has begun a slow spin up. That'll help stabilize the satellite. It'll retain that spin when it separates from the second people stage. People can people. currently the camera view has switched forward looking at the Arabsat 6A spacecraft. And if you've just joined us now, you've missed a great day. Both side boosters landed at the Cape. Center core landed, second stage right in the desired orbit. And now we're waiting for separation. <laughs> 